Hello everyone, uh, this is Raja here uh, from Acorn School of Motoring. Uh, I have got uh, Aditya here today. Uh, I'm doing his mock test. Uh, let's ask Aditya about uh, his driving experience so far. Hi Aditya, are you Hello. okay? How are you doing? Good, how are you? Good. So, um, how many lessons you had with me so far? 12 or 13. 12 or 13. And did you start it from, uh, from the scratch or you, did you have lessons before somewhere else? Scratch. From the scratch. So, you're a complete new beginner. So, you started from the scratch. This is very, very good. How many mock tests have you done so far? Three, I think. Three. So, today's your fourth mock yes. test. Good. So, you know the rules. Mm -hmm. uh, once we start our mock test and if I don't give you no instructions, you'll always be going yep. straight ahead. Yes. Now, um, Aditya is still doing practice for your show me and tell me question. So we might do this on your next mock test. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right. So guys, anybody watching the videos, um, everything Aditya do good, it will show up as a green on the screen. Uh, any minor mistake, it will show up as amber. And if there's any serious mistake, uh, it will show up as red. Uh, anybody who want to just do the mock test with me, uh, please uh, go into my Instagram, uh, which is Acorn School of Motoring. Send me a message and I will see if I can help you out. Right, Aditya. So, shall we start your mock test? Yes. Good. So, whenever you're ready, please, let's drive off, please. Drive. <coughs> The next roundabout, the turn left, please. First exit. Next roundabout, turn right, please. Third exit. One. Two. The next roundabout, turning left, please. First exit. The next traffic light, turn right please. We're going towards Blackburn, please. And I 
want you to park your car to the left, please. Park your car to the left. Yes, mirrors. Secure your car, please. Okay, so when you're ready, please, let's drive off again. So the next traffic light at the tier, I want you to turn right. Uh, the sign we're going to be following is called Ozil Tuzel. So we're turning right at yes. the next traffic light. Yes. So keep an eye out for a sign for Ozil Tuzil up until further instructions, okay? And I want you to park your car to the left, please. There's a base over there. Sorry. Let's carry on driving now, yeah. please.
Okay, so the next traffic light, we're still going towards Ozil Chuzel. So I want you to turn left at the next traffic light. Yes. And the one after traffic light, we're turning right. So we're turning left and then right, please. Yes. So now I want you to follow the sign, black burn please, okay? Yes. So we're going straight ahead, yes. second exit. Yes. Again, start following the sign back.
Good. So that's your independent driving is finished. Yeah. I will give you further instructions yeah. from here, okay? The next mini roundabout, turn left, first exit base. I want you to turn next right, please. Next right. The signal there is for going straight ahead, but we are turning right. Okay. And I want you to park your car to the left, please. Yes. Thank you, and then drive off again when you're ready, please. So I want you to turn next left, please. Yes. Next left. The next mini roundabout, turn left. Yes. The next roundabout, Aditya, I want you to turn right. And as you turn right, we're going to be turning immediately left. So we're turning right and then left in the roundabout.
want you to turn next right, please. Next right. I want you to park your car to the left after this white van before that white car because yes. we're going to do the parallel parking. So just park your car after this yes. white van, please. Try not to go too close to the front small white car if you can. Give yourself one or two cars length if you can. That's fine, Ati. That's fine. Security. That. That's fine. Right. So what I want you to do, I want you to use that car in the front. And I want you to do the parallel parking, please, whenever yes. you're ready. Yes. Yes. Okay, I'm done. Okay. Right, so when are we ready? Let's drive off, please. Next roundabout, turning left, please. Yes. First exit. The next traffic light, we're turning right, please, going towards Lower Darby. Yes.
the next mini roundabout, turn left, please, first exit. Next roundabout, turn right, please. Third exit. Yes. Roundabout, I want you to go straight ahead, second exit, please, towards services. Next up about returning left first exit space. The next roundabout turning right please third exit towards DSA driving test center. That is your mock test finish over here. Make a U turn and park up somewhere. And we're going to discuss about your test. Right, Aditya. 
that's your mock test finish over here how do you think you did your mock test um better than before but still not good enough definitely definitely better than before why you think it's not good enough i mean the first 10 minutes you had to stop my you had to use the steering wheel and i missed the parallel park and i missed a parking the first parking you told me to, to park, I missed it. You told me to park to the left and I missed it. So what is the factor of you think is failing your test? Um, the parking bit, I think there was the bus coming. I should have been more cautious about that. Okay. Right, so what I'm going to do now. And the parallel park was, everything was going fine. It was going perfectly. I've never done that perfectly until I got confused with my wheel. Yes, because it was so easy, but I'll yeah. explain to you now in a minute. So I'm going to go through from the top up until the last mistakes. So the first ever mistake it was. Now in your exam, I have to put my hand on the steering because I asked you to pull over to the left. The reason why I have to put my hand because the way you were going, I'm 100% certain you would have hit that curb over there. Mm -hmm. Now in your exam, examiner will not do that. He would rather let you hit the curb. Obviously. I don't want to damage the tires, so this is why I have to put my hand. So that would have been a serious factor because you would have hit the curb anywhere. <laughs> you would have been bringing you back anyway. So I complete, I'm going to I'll carry on doing full of your mock test anyway. Now the second one, when we were following the sign Ozil Trizzle, there was a one area I said to you, park up your car to the left. There was a small base over there. Mm -hmm. I don't think so. You made enough observation to realize there was a very small, tiny area. Mm -hmm. And by the time you realize, you've already gone past yeah. it. So if that happened in your exam, it's not going to be failure. It's just a minor. So, I mean, I didn't put any CS over there, just a minor. So sometimes it's happened. But I hope that you will do much better observation mm -hmm. next time. Okay. Now, you know the traffic light where yeah. I say to you, we're turning left the traffic light. And then we are turning right the traffic yeah. light. Your left turning was fine. I did nothing wrong with it. But as you turn left, it is a long lane. Yeah. What you did? I signal too early. You signal way too early. Again, yeah. is a minor. Because I yeah I, I I thought like the right turning would be straight off I turn left. I did not speed properly. That's fine. Again, it's all learning curves, isn't it? Yeah. So you should have signaled when you're about five or six cars length away from the junction. Okay. Now, second. That traffic light, what type of junction is it? Is it a T-junction or crossroad junction? It's a T-junction. Crossroad junction. Okay, I, I, sorry, I, I, I don't, yeah. Yeah, so when the light goes green, what happened? You were carrying on sitting, you are. You should have gone more forward. Oh, okay. And should have been in the middle okay. of the road. Okay. The, the one where I signaled too early? Correct. Yeah, yeah, okay. I should have gone too early. Okay. Yeah, because it's a crossroad yeah. junction. I was too... Controlled by the traffic light. Yeah, because you didn't leave your junction. Again, it's a minor, but if somebody would have to risk overtaking you going in the middle, that could have been a different scenario. Okay. So always read the road ahead, okay? Mm -hmm. Now, the Shadward roundabouts... Was good, right? There was extremely good. Apart from the very, very, very first one. Yeah. Very first one, all of the roundabouts, Shedward ones, are open view roundabouts. Yeah. The That's reason why, what happened? Yes, you stopped. Yeah. But was there any car coming? No. Was there any car coming from no. straight ahead? No. There was no reason for you to stop. But after that, I think you realized your mistake yeah. and then you were really good. You were doing observation nice and early. Yeah. And your lane discipline was excellent. Your Mirrors and timing of a signal was excellent as well. So that's really, really good. Okay. Now, as we done all that, there was a temporary traffic light. Yeah, when you told me to turn to the I right. I asked yeah, you to turn well. right. But do you realize the temporary traffic light and you have got enough time to go to the right? We're not going to block anybody, isn't mm -hmm. it? Yeah? yeah. So why are we stopping then? Will that be a major? Because like well, I, the reason why I have to give you as a major there because I have to tell you to do oh, it. Okay. If the examiner have to tell you to do something, is a major. But the thing is, in your exam, chances are, examiner will say nothing to you. But chances are, people behind because you were signaling, they might start beeping at you, telling you, "Come on, you can go if you want to turn right." Okay. So, if the light, 
is further back a little bit and the turning right is ahead then it makes sense for you to stop the traffic light but we were turning right so you should have done it okay so when you turn right you realize it was a 20 road you were absolutely fine nothing wrong with that uh, So that maximum road we did, which is 20 miles per hour road, there was one roundabout. I said to you, the next roundabout, turn right yeah. and then turn left. Yeah, yeah, I remember, I remember. Okay. That roundabout, from your right side, open or close view? I think it was, I, I can't remember, I can't remember. Is that is a close view. Okay, so okay. I should have stopped. Okay. Because you need to stop, lean your body forward, yeah and have a look so we call it LADA L-A-D-A so you should have looked assess decide and act what if there was a car coming quite fast yeah. while you were turning he would have hit you so on a close view on the bus you should have stopped yourself over there okay now maneuvers you were doing so well <laughs> everything was going in your way up until you decided so I told you one to the left, yeah, two to the right, two to the right and then, the but what happened when your car become parallel, you did not I do it. the wheel. That's it. This is why should things was wrong for you. And if you could have done it, you would have been fine. Oh, yeah. And that's the only reason your maneuver gone absolute disaster. It was disaster. You were doing so good observations. You were in full control of the car oh, so up wrong. until a simple mistake. This is why I'm telling you, you need to remember this. One to the left two to the right when your car become parallel you must do one to the left i know what you were thinking your car was out which is fine once you done it one to the Caught left to the right and, and the then left. go yeah. to the left yeah. and then right yeah <laughs> but you learn but you're never gonna forget this yeah. now and obviously it will be in a video but, but it was still better of a parallel it was yeah. absolutely it yeah. was good but unfortunately yeah. still a serious yeah. though. Yeah. Um, the last thing um i will say to you that road which is a 40 miles per hour road i can see you have made progress very well what you should have done before yes. you did you do that i think i think i did okay i, I, I think you that. didn't but i will check in the camera i think you didn't so yeah. I, I put it over there check your mirrors before you speed up yeah. okay so unfortunately so let me have a look how many mistakes you have got so you got one two three four five six seven eight so you've got nine total mistakes yeah. out of nine let's see how many series you have you got so one for the hand, uh, one for the turning right, which I have to give instructions, three. So you have got total three serious fault. Yeah. Again, you, your test is in February, am I right? We're going to be doing more mock tests anyway. Your target is reduce this nine. Yeah. Okay. And serious one should have happened. Definitely uh, serious one, okay. So, um, any question for today's mock test? No, no? you sure? right okay so overall i think it was a good effort we were going to do more mock tests and hopefully you will improve okay right okay guys um that's it for today uh thanks for watching the video um hopefully i will see you guys on your next video goodbye goodbye thank you take care bye